Hey guys, and welcome back to another video of Torium Online. But it's a little bit different. It's technically a One Life series currently. I still don't know what to call it entirely. It's like Minecraft Hardcore. You get one life, you die, it's over, I delete the character. Enough said. If you want to know more about it, you can watch previous videos, even though there's only two of them currently. I might as well show my stats just to, uh see how far we've come over time and we can jump right into this I need to go to Nissel Mountain so uh, you know what boss is waiting for me to solo there huh I just leveled up from completing part of the story quest I guess considering I literally came to Nissel Mountain and then I leveled up so that's kinda weird I see some treasure chests up there that I'm gonna wanna get and there's also a certain drop in this specific map that I would like to have because I kind of just skipped it with my other characters. Never even acquired... I th well, maybe I did acquire it at one point accidentally and then I instantly got rid of it because I didn't want it. But I'm going to grab these chests real quick and then we're going to... Of course it's safe with Sophie City, why wouldn't it be? But we're going to see if we can get some of these guys to drop what they can drop 25 boar uh, you are you have more health than a larveca I can definitely say that however I can still one hit KO you proper well one hit KO you with a uh, decent critical I also should work on getting a better katana considering I'm still running on one that is uh, below 10 damage or 10 attack Okay, he's dead. Yeah, the one I'm currently using has six attack. Yeah, that's that's not good at all. We use this one. Increase attack speed just slightly. And it does a lot more damage. Oh, there's the uh there's the big boy, the giant boar. We all know I can't kill that thing. Well I could if I switched characters, but that's not what this is about. Alright, well uh I'm gonna try and see if I can get these boars to drop their armor just so I can actually have an upgrade of armor because this leather armor kind of sucks butt. Well, I've officially killed 90 boars and I haven't gotten anything. I am currently like insanely tired for some reason and I'm I am legit considering taking a nap, pausing the recording, taking a nap and coming back like 3 hours later because this uh, this is kind of ridiculous. You know, the first time I fought the dragon uh, with my dual swords character, I got it to drop its armor just random chance. Yeah, I've almost killed 100 boars, and I can't get them to drop their armor, which is, well, which should be a much higher drop chance in comparison. It might still be low, yes, but it should not be 1% low, but I guess it may be. Yeah, I am uh, tired of these boars. I'm also level 30 35 now, not 37, level 35. Because uh, I killed so many of these that I actually leveled up. But now that they're uh, 10 levels away from me instead of 9, they drop like a quarter of the, H of the, quarter of the XP, and I'm still at 18%. At least th these things face uh, no threat to me, and I have don't have to worry about dying while killing them. Oh my god, we finally got it. That took too damn long. There's a siren outside. Kinda close-ish. I don't know if you can hear it, but I can and it's kind of annoying. And, uh, let's see. Max HP. I literally gain 6 more defense and 20 more HP. And I don't have the light uh, form of it, so I don't have any dodge, do I? No, I don't. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to go do that before I actually go fight this boss. I'm also curious what this character now looks like without the old cloak on. Um, worse, honestly, because it's such basic armor, I cannot stand the look of it. Alright, let's see where's the cloak, get that back on, and I'm just gonna... I'm gonna go get this armor into the light form, and then... I'll probably just be fighting the boss straight after that. Oh, just for your information, that took me 25 minutes to get. 
should not have taken me 25 minutes to get. Well, I've made it to the Brutal Dragon to sell. I am underleveled, and we do have assistance from the, uh, from the NPCs, which is going to be the only fight where we get assistance. And I'm going to hurry up and kill these crystals because I know that they're going to be a pain in the butt. And I know that I could not solo this, uh, this boss. That's not going to happen. I'm doing, you know, 100 damage per hit, give or take, without a critical. When it has 53,000 HP, yeah, I just did 1,000 damage total. I did 2% of its HP with one Isen. Yeah, I kind, honestly, I kind of need it to uh, aggro towards me in order to do massive damage to this thing. Can I get a, yeah, Pommel Strike. Paralysis actually worked. Uh, it didn't last for long, but it did work. That is uh, kind of surprising. Uh, Balft is going, getting, uh, you know, weak. I've also discovered something that I can do the double hit again. Like when you uh, do the first unsheath attack, uh, you get a double, double swing. I can do that if I'm from a distance and I uh, reactivate the auto attack. It dashes in and it does the uh, double hit. So uh, there's a nice unsheath attack. That's uh, pretty interesting, I thought. I just discovered that when, you know, killing ba almost 100 boars, if not actually 100. I also forgot I have the dodge thing. I should probably make use of it. Why did I use Pulse Blade? Pulse Blade is uh, not, not the skill I need to use against this thing. Oh, I've gained aggro. Oh, bad things happened. Bad things have happened. Uh, oh, I did get Bouncing Blade off. Holy crap. I did. I don't have MP to activate it again. And... Yep. Oh, Balft is back in the fight. There we go. That's kind of weird. I will take it, though. Uh, right. Oh, it didn't do the dash. That's kind of weird. There we go. Try and get my MP back, so, uh... If this thing is still aggroed towards me, which it is... Oh man, I just definitely messed up that uh, Bouncing Blade. Good thing I don't know this thing's attack pattern, and the uh, AoE attacks like that, I don't know how they work. That's good. Um, that totally gives me hope for uh, beating this boss completely solo, because uh, that's not going to happen. Really? Did you actually just hit me? Oh god, yep, get out of that. Get a nice ice in going with a 2,000, 2000 damage done. Yeah, uh, this boss will not be soloed on normal, I can tell you that already. Considering, uh, I can't do damage to it at all. Like, we're, we're just whittling away its HP at this point. Even with a 2,000 damage attack, which is the highest I can do, I'm still barely putting a dent in this thing's HP. Like, really, we are just taking down its HP bit by bit. I can't even attempt to use a, uh, blind, uh, the, da the slash, the, uh, blinding, what is it? Bouncing blade? I got that one off, even though it didn't look like it did. I, uh, I did my, da my, uh, sidestep thing the wrong way, so that's nice. Bouncing Blade, it looked like it didn't activate, but it in fact did, even though I still took massive damage from that thing. I love that. Skip through this story, explore here a little bit longer, because I would like to kill this boss on easy by myself. Did I not get a chest from this thing? Did I, did that just not happen? You're telling me I, it didn't drop anything. The last time I beat this within the story, it, it dropped things. Like, it legit dropped its armor and several normal items. This time, it, it didn't drop shit. Recommended level 37. Yeah, I don't... I don't think we're gonna win that fight. So I'm just going to, uh... Oh, 5,300. Easy numbers. I think I can beat it by itself. I can totally beat this thing. Ooh, bad foot cramp, wow. Yeah, I can totally beat this thing on easy. Uh, normal's just not gonna happen. Wow, you're already starting with that? How dare you? And we're already messed up by the damn crystals. 
Bouncing Blade. Yeah, we got a 18, 1800 hit with Bouncing Blade. I'm not sure what that uh, blue thing was, but it makes me scared of anything, I guess. Well, we can beat it on easy, which you should be able to beat all story monsters or story bosses for the first time on easy. Really should be able to. But, uh, I, I can't solo you. That's not going to happen. Damn. Alright, well, uh, let's move on to the next story boss, shall we? Well, I've been farming these, uh, what are they called? Fire ghosts for a few minutes now because they can drop a katana and body armor. Never in my Toram history have I ever gotten them to drop the body armor. So that's pretty unfortunate, but I did just get them to drop this, uh, dark element katana. That's pretty good. Too bad, uh, it's not really gonna help me against bosses, because I don't think the bosses I'm gonna fight are going to be, uh, light element. I think the next one I'm gonna fight, uh, well, the next hard one I'm gonna fight is going to be a fire. Which I assume I would need a water katana, but I don't know where to get one of those, and I won't be getting one of those. Well, 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 Mochilo, we meet again. Mochilo, every time I've battled you in the story, I've actually won solo. So I'm not scared about fighting you. What I'm scared about is what comes after you. Oh, wow. Oh, jeez, Bouncing Blade actually hit properly. But, uh... Machilo attacks very slow, I just found out, because uh, I tried to do Bouncing Blade, and man, it took forever for him to hit me, but it still worked. And he just ran away, which gives me the advantage. Get away from that. Come on, attack me. Not that way. Get a nice Ison going, then. Every time you're gonna do a red area, I'm gonna do a uh, Ison, if I have the MP for it. I'll just, uh, make things fair. Because you're not hitting me. There we go. Bouncing Blade, 6,000. You know, that was good almost 7,000 damage uh, hit. It's pretty good. Machilo is not really much of a uh, problem, though. And we'll just get back in. And I don't think Mochilo is a light element. I don't think... Oh, man, that's... I hate that. It didn't activate properly. There we go. I hate that if you're in the middle of a combo, you can't interrupt your own attack to, uh, do a skill. That's, that's pretty annoying, I have to say that. And now I have to recover MP doing this. There we go, we got good MP recovery, and then get another MP. Bouncing Blade. Nice. That's a, almost 6,000 damage hit right there. Oh, I have enough MP. Bouncing Blade, there we go, 4,300, 1,200, you know, 5,500, decent. Get one bar of MP recovered, get another two bars, holy crap! Man, uh, that, that skill is really powerful for MP recovery, naturally. Bouncing Blade. Okay, well, that's stupid that it can't activate during bleeding, even though... Bouncing Blade should negate that bleeding. Yeah, notice how I had no problems with Mochilo at all. It just took time. The Brutal Dragon probably would have just killed me. Uh, that's nice, yeah. Skip that. Uh, I know, I know, I know, game. And I've leveled up to 38. Almost to 39. Let's open this treasure chest. I, I got medicine. That sucks. Flame Butterfly. How's it going? Oh, uh, a minute ago, I did look up where to get a water katana, and uh, it's not going to happen. The next the next katana I can get that has a water element, the easiest one is dropped by the boss Ooze at the end of Luteros Cav Cavern. That's going to only be like 20, 30 more levels higher, and uh, the drop chance is probably going to be quite low, so it's not going to happen. How much- well, hold up, how much did that flame- how much experience did that flame butterfly drop? Because I'm at 94%. 96. Ooh. 
Okay, well, 98. Well, we'll just uh, we'll just level up right here. Why, why, why won't we just level up? Get nice ice and perfect. Now we're 39. The higher the level I am, the better. Because I am going to need the levels here. Actually, I should probably maybe raise my vitality some. Because uh, I could use... It increases 13... 13 HP increased per skill point. So if I get it up to, uh, well, 10, it would increase my HP by 130. That's not bad. I'm going to probably invest 10 points, so I need to level up once again. Just to uh, give myself a slight boost in uh, HP, because I, I will need it, I can tell you that much. And if I'm just going to be grinding away at bosses... As long as I have HP and defense to uh, take care of it, I can do it. Well, I shouldn't say defense, because my defense is 56. It was 45 earlier, but uh, yeah, it doesn't doesn't get much better. All right, Machilo, um, let's uh, let's fight again. Why not? You were fun. The brutal dragon wasn't fun. I spent a lot of time on this recording already, and I still have another boss that I should go attempt to fight. Or go back to the Brutal Dragon, and if I die, well, that'll just have to be the end of things. Because uh, all, all things must come to an end someday, and uh, we'll definitely learn our lesson, won't we? Okay, I want to get the auto attack off, so I'm ready to counter. Well, auto attack didn't really uh, work for me there. Jeez, okay, well... Oh, damn it, game, really... How do I cancel the auto attack? I just have to stand out of range? Is that how I cancel it? Okay, it interrupted that attack, that uh, auto attack for some reason, Bouncing Blade did, but in the past it uh, hasn't interrupted it. Um, I also need to figure out how to get more MP. I'm currently sitting at a very low amount of 4, and I would like to... Uh, get more back more not more back I would just like to have more in general when Chilo attack and then I'll come in for a swoop regain MP get an ice and off back up do that again get more MP back off how did you hit me you were not within range of anything hit that also what does four do oh it I forgot that's a uh, that's a buff isn't it Come on, attack me. There we go. Eh, we did probably about 8,000 damage. Could have been worse. Could have been better, though. Machilo, what are you doing? You're being, uh, you're being aggressive, aren't you? Get that nice, you know, 2,600 hit. Bouncing blade. I, that was at the very end of the uh, animation, but I'll take it. Don't have enough bouncing blade. Yep, evaded that. Perfect. I am very late at narrating things that happen, so if it seems like there's lag, there definitely isn't. I'm just uh, late to the party of announcing things. Let's swing there. Bouncing blade. Perfect. Eh, that was only like a 5,000 damage hit. That wasn't too good. Dodge that, because I wasn't ready to use Bouncing Blade in that situation. Slash again, slash again. Bouncing Blade. Okay, it worked, and perfect. Mochilo attacks really slow for me to use Bouncing Blade. It's kind of annoying, honestly. But, uh, hey, we beat it again. Wow, such a surprise that we killed that thing. And only went up uh, 34% of my experience. I was hoping I would go up more, considering these flame butterflies are taking me up a good bit by themselves. But they don't drop anything I'm after, and I think I know a good way to end this uh, end this video because obviously I won't be able to beat the Flare Volg. That's not going to happen on normal. I don't even know if it's going to happen on easy. So uh, I'm going to need to do some leveling, but I uh. I have somebody I want to go fight real quick. I think I want to add a new rule to this series. For every story mode boss, 
I have to be able to solo it on normal before I can move on to the next part of the story. Obviously, I've already partially done that. I've beaten Mochilo at this point, but I, I want to be able to solo this dragon before I ever collide with the Flare Volg. Because I have a 0% zero, zero chance of soloing that Flare Volg on normal. I know that. I'll have to do some serious leveling if I want to attempt it. The Brutal Dragon... I still don't think I can solo it at my current level, but if I can, now's the time to find out. And just because I fight it and lose doesn't mean I die. I can run away. So, uh, we're gonna try it. I'm gonna start this battle here. I'm going to use a support item, because I get them free with the story, might as well. It's not really gonna help me much anyways, honestly. Uh, might as- you know what? Just use a whole bunch of them. Why not? It can't hurt. All of this is just going- uh, training gem, nope. All of this is just going to assist me. Um, I'm going to take out the crystals really quickly. Use skills, take them out. Because, uh, they're only gonna be a hindrance to me. And, yeah. Oh, shoot. That's not what I wanted. Why am I not attacking? Hold up, there we go. It wouldn't let me attack. I was hitting F on the dragon and I could not attack. Nope, get away from that. Ice and please. Son of a bitch, that ignite already hit. Wait, how did you hit me with an, uh, a flame attack? When when did you hit me with a flame attack? Yeah, I'm kind of confused when I got hit here. Not entirely sure when this happened, but uh, that's fine. Just evade that real quick. Get an Ison going. I mean, theoretically, I could solo this guy. No problem, right? Bouncing Blade. Uh, well, that... I don't know how much that actually helped me. I should try and keep all of my dashes, because I'm going to need them. I know that. My MP is boosted because of one of the gems. Uh, my build, my uh, dash skill... I don't know, dash attack versus... Uh, what the hell? Bouncing Blade didn't work, question mark? Bouncing Blade didn't work, but I didn't get hit either, even though it was attacking. I don't understand. Get out of that, perfect. Get that MP recovery, I did not mean to waste that. Ison. okay, I'm pretty sure I can solo the Brutal Dragon. I can't even get, like, a Bouncing Blade off, it's just not happening. I don't have the, uh, lineup for it. Like, I mean, I could do it within there, but then that's also a guaranteed ignite and hit, which I would heal, but uh, it's better to not risk it. I may just be stuck using Ison for now. Unless this thing will do a normal attack on me, then I can uh, line it up, but it's not going to. It really doesn't want to. It. Oh, then it, it does, but I'm not ready for it. Alright, is it going to do it again? Nope, that's, that's not what I need. Yeah, okay, Brutal Dragon is soloable. This is this is possible. Unless its attack pattern changes and I get hit by that. I tried to dash, it wouldn't let me. Gotta love that when I, the attack animation ends, but a uh, shift doesn't work. Yeah, it's always a fun time, Ison. Of course you guarded it, why wouldn't you? I hope I'm out of that. Well, I was. Oh, come on. I like how you're just... You're barely, you're truly barely even attacking. Like, you're doing that constantly, but that's not hard to dodge. It really isn't. I can just walk out of it most of the time. Get an ice and going, yeah, okay, you're... Oh, I, damn it, game. Okay, that that's fair. Yeah, I just got hit by uh, two attacks in a row because I couldn't activate Bouncing Blade in time because of the attack animation. Why can't you just cancel your own auto attack? Like, why is that not a thing that this game does? I'm doing one swing. You're telling me I can't just immediately end it? Like, really, game? But then it, it forces me to attack when I'm within range, so I can't just sit here and wait for it to hit me. Like, here, I'm gonna try it, even though it has no HP left. You know what? That next red area, I'm going to uh, going to use a bouncing blade and end this. 
Okay, or not, because it forced me to dash forward, because I wasn't within range. Got it. Love it. Well, I I soloed the Brutal Dragon. Yeah, that happened. Um, Let's do it again. <laughs> let's see if the first one was a fluke. Actually, I kind of just want to level up. That's the main reason I'm doing it, just to get up to level 40. And to uh, get a little bit more experience fighting this thing. Alright, well, same as last time. Take down these crystals first. Uh, oh, I see. The dragon was attacking me from a distance. It wasn't the crystal with the uh, red circle. Oh, jeez. Ow. Thanks for the poison. Oh, I see. I see earlier what the blue damage was. It was the damn poison. Uh, I don't have MP to fight right now, so uh, I'm going to have to dodge that. There we go. Dodge that. Oh, that was a waste. I could have did the sideways. Oh, I just wasted the sideways dash. Oh, no. Come on. There we go. I need that. Okay, well, you missed. I don't think the Brutal Dragon Desil has a, a good accuracy rate. Or I already have a good evasion rate. Because I haven't had a... I haven't had an issue with m most of his normal attacks hitting me. Damn it, game! Oh my god. I hate that. I try and activate the... Activate the damn bouncing blade and it won't let me activate it, but then I get hit because I'm activating, I'm, I am activating it on time, but the game doesn't let me activate it on time. I absolutely love that. How do I turn off auto attack? How do I make it so when, I, when I'm within range it doesn't do that? Because it's honestly really irritating. Because I could just sit here and not do any auto attack. So uh, leave a comment down below if you know how, but uh, by the time you comment that, and by the time this video is up, who knows, I may be dead by then, because the Flare Volg may happen. But uh, yeah, Brutal, Brutal Dragon, uh, no challenge, well, it's not really a challenge. The challenge is using Bouncing Blade, which isn't a requirement, so it's not, it's not a problem, it's just annoying that the game won't let me use it when I want to use it, and like that, it attacked before I thought it was going to attack, so Bouncing Blade wouldn't have worked anyways. I could stay in that, but then uh, I don't know the timing for it. God, not that. I barely dodged that one. Come on, come attack me normally, come on. There you go. I, see? I was hitting it! before it fucking hit me, but it- I hate that. My attack animation ends, but I can't do anything yet. Well, maybe with higher attack speed, my attack animation would be, a uh, severely quick- not severely, significantly quicker, and so I could, uh, activate it whenever I wanted to, because I should be able to do- Okay, that was the first- first bouncing blade we got off, and it still hit me like a fucking truck. And I can't escape that. I, mm, pretty sure I was out of that circle by then. But sure. Yeah, there's no point in me using Bouncing Blade. This fight is literally just me using Ison and dodges. Dodge, dash, and Ison. Nothing else. Nothing else helps. Well, you know, well, we got a bit good Bouncing Blade that time with a good 5,000 damage. And then he double attacks, and so he smacks me with his damn tail before I can get out of it. Can you remove my my slow, please, before you attack again? That would be great. I don't have enough MP. And there we go. Dead. Wonderful. That is severely irritating to solo. And Flare Volg is gonna be so much fucking worse. You don't even drop any items. And I'm at 99... At 99% experience, that, that is, that's something, all right. So we're just going to go make that 0%, I can't go down that cliff, are you serious? I'm going to go make it 0% real quick so I can get up to level 40. Because there's no sense in me sitting. That's a freaking run. Okay, well, I need the MP. Man, I cannot do any damage to you, damn. Okay, what level are you? 
you're lower level, but you may drop more experience, or enough for me to level up. Or just not enough at all. There we go. There's level 40. How wonderful. Now I can put things here. Um, yeah, none of the- not, not using any of that. Uh, Vitality. Yeah. Let's- I- my- Vitality is a mistake. I don't need it. I really don't. But, uh, well, that's gonna be the end of this video. It has been an extra long recording due to these boars being a pain in the ass to farm. Um, I can solo the Brutal Dragon to seal actually pretty damn easily. So that's not a problem. Uh, Mochila was not a problem. Continuing the story later on is going to be a problem. And I need to start from Deuce Hamlet. Yeah, well, uh, that's, uh, we'll see what happens then, but... If you enjoyed this series where nothing really is changing, um, consider leaving a like or a comment and uh, watch next the next video, because hopefully it'll get better. Even though I swear last episode was better with the Minotaur, because I swear the Minotaur was more challenging for me to do it first until I learned how to use Bouncing Blade, but then I can't use Bouncing Blade against Brutal Dragon very easily, but that's that's fine, whatever. If you enjoyed this video, you know, leave a like. Just do that, or a comment, and I hopefully will see you next video. Goodbye.